Hello ladies and gents, I am the Rev, and this is The Long Dark. This game has got to be one of the longest games that I've covered on my channel, by far. I have the original build, and I'm going to put that in the first link down in the description. You guys will see that uh, I have all of the original builds, and as they actually were moving aggressively forward and really getting somewhere, Hinterland Studios that is, up until... I stopped covering this game four years ago because it took them so long to accomplish anything. Plain and simple, your game's in early access for seven years. Eh, luckily, it's one of the probably by far one of my favorite survival games there is. And when I jumped in and checked out my old save, A, it worked, which I was shocked. B, I started noticing, oh, they've gone through and completely changed a whole bunch of stuff around. The second and third episodes. So part uh, two and three, I saw a lot of differences. It's not difficult, but what I thought we'd do is we're going to start with episode one. I will show you guys how to survive and thrive and if you want to jump into the sandbox and see how long you can go, they've got a whole bunch of different modes. It's not just this story. They've got a huge sandbox with all kinds of different stuff. Some years they do stuff on Halloween and Christmas and stuff. Sometimes they don't. But again, what can you do? So we're going to jump into episode one and we're going to just hammer this out. You guys let me know down in the comments. Have you played the game? Do you want to play the game? This is for Xbox, PlayStation, um, of course, PC on Steam, not Epic, Epic Game Store. So you guys let me know what you think. Smash that like button. I'll put these out as fast as you guys want to do them. Astrid. Astrid! Righty. The Joker. Seems about right. <sighs> Feels like another record cold snap on the way. I'd better get a fire going before the pipes freeze up again. Not a problem. And if you're curious, yes, I did cut off the very beginning of the game. Because it's, um, there's no talking, it's just a whole bunch of music and cutscenes, so. Alright, well, what do we got? Can we... No accelerant? Alright, we'll give it a shot. Doesn't always work. But, depending on the conditions surrounding you at the time, it can Turned out pretty well. Let's throw another log on there. There we go. Ooh, that'd be where we sleep. Ooh, a dream catcher. Yep, we'll take that. Oh, it's not really letting us go through everything yet. Let's see, you can eat that way if you wish, or you can eat straight from the um, menu. There we go. This is what we currently look like. Our gear set ain't much. What well, we got? McKinsey's boots. Flex for all with the boots for flying and operating in wild places. All right. And we've got our journal here. We got memories. What is this? People actions. There we go. So as you go through, it's got all kinds of little partial hints to tell you what's up.
Jackrabbit remote transport. Zero flights a day to the mainland communities and, well, anywhere really. What do we got? Herbal tea, which helps you sleep. I can't go outside. Well, here we are, old girl. Your best flights may be behind you, but you're still beautiful to me. And anyways, you're all I've got. I'd sure love to give you one last great adventure. Oh, your your wish shall happen. That's a joke. I don't remember needing my parka this early in the season. It seems to get colder every year. Oh, gimme, gimme. Okay. Okay, so we gotta find more, something else to click on here. Now you'll see these things all over the game, bits and pieces. You'll see the same stuff we've got here. Ah, cheap electric crap. Yes, that's what we had to clip on. Never works when you need it. Getting pretty late in the day. Guess I could take a nap. There we go. Who could that be? Jack Rabbit Remote Transport, Mackenzie speaking. I told her not to come up. I told her you couldn't fly in this weather. For once, will you not be so damn Whoa, well, well, slow down, Maureen. What are you talking about? She just showed up. Said you'd see her. Said you'd fly her north. I know you need the money. The weather service... It's okay, Maureen. I've got it from here. Oh. Uh, uh. Hello, Will. What are you doing here? It's been a while, I know. Yeah. Years. I haven't heard from you since... I know. I know. And I wouldn't be here if it weren't important. Well... What brings you... I mean... Are you sick? <laughs> no. No, not me. But I need to get to someone who is. Right. So you're still a doctor? Yes, I'm still a doctor. I thought that after... <laughs> Why are you here? I need your help. There's an isolated community in the northern part of Great Bear. Someone there is very sick. Great and... Bear? There's nothing there anymore. Not since... Th I know. But I have to get there. Still trying to save the world, huh? Somebody has to. What's that supposed to mean? Mackenzie, uh, Will, I didn't come here to fight about the past. I need a pilot to take me somewhere remote. Someone who won't ask too many questions. Someone I can trust. Wait, questions? Astrid, are you in trouble? Are you gonna help me or not? What's in the case? See, there's that thing about no questions, remember? What's in the case, Astrid? No questions. Look, the weather out there is bad. Bad. I mean, it's getting worse. You walk in here after years. I could have been dead. You could have been. And then you show up and you want me to just risk my life flying into the middle of the great northern nowhere to deliver you and some mystery metal case to some remote wilderness outpost, all because you walked in here and asked me to? Yes. 
Astrid, you can't bring him back. This isn't about that. I know how hard it's been. No. You don't know, Mackenzie. You don't know anything. You don't think I feel it too? Are you gonna take me or not? The longer I wait, the worse it'll get. Damn it. Look, I don't have time for this. Wait. The worse what will get? Why do I have a feeling you're not talking about the weather? Because I'm not. Throw your bags in the plane. I'll get started on pre-flight. Better buckle up tight, because it's going to be a rough ride. Let's see. Two people, plus enough fuel to get us out to Great Bear and back leaves. Hmm. Almost no capacity for cargo. If we're too heavy, we'll burn through our fuel before we get there. I'll have to be careful about what else I take with me. The distress pistol kit is heavy, but I'd hate to end up in an emergency situation without it. Oh, hell yeah. Um, so, the distress pistol is phenomenal. It will take and it will keep the wolves off of you? Water. Energy bars, purification tablets. Breakfast to champions. Astrid's a doctor, so we're covered there. But probably Where best to have some extra up? meds just in case. The mysterious case. Astrid definitely doesn't want to talk. Astrid's traveling pretty light. Wherever she's going, she must not be planning to stay long. Oh, really? We can't take a hacksaw with us? Okay. Again. Okay. Just going over everything here. Not going to take the tea. Firewood is definitely a good idea. Now, is it going to let us get in here yet? Oh, okay. And we can't open those containers. We're not going to have any weapons. That will be for starting a fire. Oh, a map. Great Bear Island. Dad used to fly there all the time. He said it used to be beautiful. Not much reason to go there these days, since the quakes and all. Melting snow, boiling water, and cooking food. I don't think any more of that would be a good idea. What I don't see is anything uh, accelerant. Oh, well. Right. So you can either start with or without a Zekado. Hopefully it gives us that parka. We're really going to need it. Grab my parka and we can go. All right, got the flare gun. That's the important thing. There we go. Now let's see what we wind up with. That's his ex-wife. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, I just forgot to take it off. So 
I wear mine too. Why? Memories, I guess. I thought you wanted to forget. Not all of it. Look. I, I should have looked for you. It's okay. I've kept busy. I've moved on. You sure? Because this all seems pretty familiar. You still working with that researcher, Doctor? What's his name? No. No, I'm not working at the center anymore. Well, then where? I'm working on my own. Freelance, you could say. Freelance doctor? That sounds legit. I don't question your life choices, Mackenzie. Plenty of things you could be doing besides hanging out in your dad's old plane and drinking in the daytime. Hey, we had a lot of good times in this plane. And it's under control. I know, okay? I'm not here to fight, really. I think about him all the time, you know? I know you do. But I did. The choice I made. I did it for us. You don't have to. Let's just not... No. It's important that you hear this. There's things I need to Mackenzie, say. Mackenzie, not now. There's... Just let me tell you. Will, shut up for a second. Something's wrong. That is not good. What's going on? Power's gone. The whole electrical system looks fried. Shit! What's happening? No power means we're going down. Hold tight. the windshield. Trees broke my fall. Oh, mostly. Oh no, we're not gonna try and break anything down by hand. We got here was this first book. aid. Cloth. I think the cloth we will make into a first aid item. We will need a little reclaimed wood. My fingers feel numb. Now oh. well, we gotta make our fire to survive the cold. So, what does it say first? Start a fire. Oh. You don't have any accelerant. Hope it works. Feels so good. I need to rest up. Oh, not yet. Okay, so we've got a bandage. Sleep in the cave, use fish uh, to stop a bleeding loss. So we go here. Oh my god, look at all this. So, Jesus. That's a lot of crap to take care of. Alright, so we'll get rid of blood loss, I guess, first.
Really? So it should give us two bandages, right? See in the bottom left corner, we're slowly warming up. Let's get ourselves all fixed up here. <sighs> That's why I was grabbing all of that cloth. Uh, cloth also is used to repair all of your clothing, but you have to get a sewing kit first. My goodness, that's a lot of those. And we'll just give us a full thing. So you can see up in this right corner, you always need to pay attention to the time. How many times do I gotta do the same thing over and over here? So, for the pain, we need painkillers. Yeah. For both. Okay. Oh, no. Why did that go so short? Shouldn't have done that. Come on. Come on. It worked. Let's see what found one of those. There we go. Let's cook some water. Else we can grab real quick. Doesn't really look like it. I'm sure, there ain't no food either. So, in certain instances like this, where we've got to kind of stand around, I will just jump cut the edit we'll have this and then we'll lay down and you make sure you got enough time on your campfire because now we've got to wait a little bit here so that we have uh, it has to be boiled it's a two-step process but don't worry we'll come across plenty of water we'll find ways But the things you want to always keep your eyes on is in the bottom left corner. Of course, all the way to the left is to keep you warm. The middle is how awake you are. The more tired you are, the more likely you are to get hurt. So you want to keep that as high as possible. Of course, water and then, of course, food. But yeah, the biggest one to really watch out for is how awake you are. You need to rest as much as possible whenever possible to keep yourself going. But again, hold on. Alrighty, and the last thing under those four indicators is your health, and the only way you get that... Oh, we're going to take it. Okay, so, let's see about sleeping now. Astrid hasn't come looking for me. Which means she can't come looking for me. Because she's hurt. Or worse. I better get back up to the crash site. Oh, and it took all of our water. Oh, that sucks. 
Okay, so again, we need to keep our eyes open for anything we can take to make a fire with. But you don't want to break anything because breaking will have you stand in place and you will get extremely cool. You can see in that bottom left corner right now, we are not doing good. I could probably climb that. Well, oh, yeah. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm going, I'm going. I'm sure this won't turn out well. Oh, you could eat anything. Okay. Helps manage pain. Since it said we needed a whole bunch of pain relief. I think I'm going to make it. And don't hold your breath. See what we get to start with here. My plane. Oh. Not sure which of us looks worse. Poor girl. This isn't how things were supposed to end. I've been looking for you. Nice. What does this say? Rose hips. Yeah. Astrid's pack. What do we get? Yes. Yeah. Yep. We just take this. Hmm. Locked. Whatever's in this case. Aspirin was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. Yeah, I'm gonna look for clues once I get done looking for my stuff because we should have a flare gun. I can eat anything right now. Which means we'd better eat. There we go. Normally you want to eat solids before you drink anything. General rule of thumb. Ooh, there's a propeller. Okay, so we can only save our asses three times. Well, more of our stuff should be around here, shouldn't it? Flare. Now, flare you can use to throw at wolves. And if you're lucky, you'll survive. Don't she definitely passed through here. I did a hurry. Okay, so these will make... Oh, no, it's not... Oh, there we go.
It will help us um, make bandages, dress wounds, all kinds of good stuff. Thing to keep in mind is you got to balance speed. With your health and what little we got going on here. Alright, so. Now the stones. You can throw. At rabbits. See, it's not something I really do. Yet. Okay, so what's our weight at? Oh, yeah, we're fine weight wise. Okay, so it is automatically putting everything up. Good, good, good. Obviously, we just follow the way she goes. She probably thinks we're dead. Ooh, what's this? Someone's been here recently. Nice. Could it have been Astrid? So there's a reason I'm looking at these branches. This is why. You can get food from them. Sometimes that's all you got. It's wood. No. Is we're not going to waste any time. Oh, is that a wolf? Mm -hmm. I better keep my distance. Because <laughs> this cold is slowly killing us. Whoa. Looks like some kind of radio tower. I must be closer to civilization than I thought. Mm. I don't know about that. A few things to always keep in mind. Never run on a downhill. Whenever you see... What's this? Ah, okay. Uh, whenever you see an upgrade, you'll see it on here on this right side. See that? That red? Yeah. You don't want to run when that happens. Because if you're tired at all, you wind up breaking something. Oh, you poor, poor dude. Someone's just sitting here, frozen. What the hell? Nice. Nope. Oh, that didn't do anything. All right, so where do we go from here? Right, a town. Maybe I can find help there. Yeah, I gotta get there first. Oh, that's how we go down. Let's 
coming back to me though this first part you just basically want to haul ass until we can get some place where we can warm up and take shelter like that house look smoke from that chimney that means someone's home Hello? Anyone out there? What happened here? Ooh, hatchet. You, we want that. <sighs> this whole area looks like it's been abandoned for a while. No. Nope. We just hit Milton. Here we go. Now we now we can survive. Hello? Anybody here? Hey. Hey, wake up. Holy <laughs> shit. Uh, wait. Hold your fire. Get back. O okay, okay. Just take it easy. Why are you here? I saw the smoke from your chimney. Outsider. Uh, what? <laughs> Thought so. Mainlander. Outsider. I don't recognize your voice. And you haven't left like the others. So, must be a Mainlander. Someone who doesn't know any better. My plane, I... I crashed in the mountains nearby. I'm looking for someone who crashed with me. A friend. She might be injured. I haven't seen her. Uh, listen, could you maybe point that gun someplace else? You think? Because my eyes are covered, I can't see you. Make the wrong move. Say the wrong thing. You'll see how good a shot I am. I don't doubt it. The others are all gone. If you're here, things must be worse than they thought. So we got different questions we can ask. Where are we? Milton, a forgotten town deep in the mountains. You're far from home. But uh, where are we on Great Bear? My plane came down in a storm, and my compass was acting funny. I've lived here all my life. Not much use for the outside world. Milton's the last of the old mountain towns. Now, it's almost impossible to get to. Or get out of. Only people left here are either too poor or too proud to leave. Which are you? I have what I need. At least I did before the bad man came. Now I'm not sure I have enough to get through the winter. I need to find my friend, but I'll do what I can to help. My mind is. Fuzzy. Some things come through so sharp. Others. Like a dream. Let me think. Let me rest. Maybe I can pull some memories out of the fog. Maybe I can find something that could help you find your friend. Name's Mackenzie, by the way. And you are? I had a name once. But for years, the townsfolk have called me Grey Mother. The name takes on its own life. Such that at one point, the name becomes the thing it belongs to. Then the old names fade. Can only be remembered by the young and the true. So, 
I should call you... You should call me Grey Mother also. Sitting here with a rifle in your hand. You expecting trouble? Trouble? <laughs> trouble found me. You mean the storm? The bad men. The bad men came. Took my things. Tried to take my house. They thought they were safe. Because Grey Mother can't see. <laughs> they were wrong. Who are the bad men? The men, they, they passed through town. The night of the storm. The night of the light. I'm looking for my friend. She crashed with me when my plane came down in the mountains. Do you think she could have come through and been caught? By these bad men? I can't say for sure. Is your friend a survivor? Yes, she is. Then there is always hope. The bad men, did they try to hurt you? Everyone thinks being old means you're weak, but they underestimated Grey Mother. It seems they did. We should be that convict that we smoked, uh, or that we saw, that we got the hatchet from. Shot him, I crashed obviously. without much food or gear myself. And if these bad men cleaned you out, we're gonna need to find some food and fuel, or neither of us is gonna make it through the next few days. You have any idea where we could find some supplies? The bad men took everything. And the others in town who would have helped me are gone. The ones left will have their own worries. It's up to you. Outsider. I'll do what I can, but I'll need your help. There must be somewhere in town to get food, fuel, the essentials. What about your friend? Aren't you in a hurry to find her? Yes, I am. And I'll be looking for signs of her. But there's a lot of ground to cover. And without gear, I won't <coughs> make it. So while I'm looking for supplies, you see what you can remember about the Night of the Lights, and if she might have passed through town. That way, maybe we can help each other. Okay, outsider. Grey Mother can't promise she can unlock the secrets in the dark cupboards of her mind. But she'll try. Okay. Now we got a map. And down south here is the Orca gas station. But we've got all of this town to search first. Because we've got to gear up. See, look, we're barely warm. Let's go upstairs. Sewing kit, want that? And every time you want one of the find one of these books, they help you. There's hunting, there's fishing, there's sewing, all kinds of stuff to help you gear up. Oh, we can't search anything yet, huh? Let's sleep for an hour. See what it does. It's already getting dark, huh? And this is how we get our water. Easy enough. Oh yeah, all everything's empty. She's got nothing.
And we'll eventually be allowed in there once we complete everything else. But we're warm, which was the main thing I wanted to do. So now... Oh, oh. Oh, no, those are just regular books. Okay, I wasn't sure. All right. So, before we leave... So, find supplies to help Grey Mother. 8,000 calories for the fridge. And fill her fire bin. So, good place to start. Is an actual house. We'll check out the other buildings soon enough. Whoop. But now we've got to watch out for wolves, because if one comes at us, it's going to kick our butt. What I'm looking for is... Hope nobody needs this anymore. There we go. Okay. This will come in. Yes, it will. Good, more matches. What do we got here? I don't want to do this, but I don't have a choice. I just can't stay in Milton anymore. It's just too empty and sad. I know I promised to stick with you through thick and thin, but I never signed up for this. I'm sorry. I'll send food when I get to the mainland. I hear they have more. There, love in. This food. 51. Boy, that's borderline. In the fridge. What's in the freezer? Okay, so probably the best thing to do is just. Alright, now it doesn't matter if we have paper because we've got the bed right in front of us. So. We can go in here, because we do have a sewing kit. And first thing... Oh, we put that cap on, didn't we? Let's see. Let's go into here. That's not it. Actions. We're not going to repair... We're going to harvest this bad boy. Okay. Oh, that takes two. So that will hold off on. These should only take one. Keep, of course, an eye on your food. 84 is not too bad. 77 is okay. How about his pants? Oh, yeah. Anything in yellow you're going to want to hit. All right. So we got... Okay, well, we can get the rest in the morning. Now, what we can do, and they should be able to do in the dark, is 
Sheet. Okay, now things are at dusk. I know you guys can barely see here. Hold on. There we go. Let's see what it's like outside. All right, all vehicles, you want to search the glove compartment. Uh, no, give me my gun. I just heard a wolf. Alright, manager's key. We'll find that later. There's any goodies in the trunk. That's the gas station. You can run down there and take, do that if you want. I like to get my guy geared and safe first. That is the first priority I have. What we got here? Hey girl, that grumpy jerk at Orca left the back door open so I snuck in. And took some stuff. I thought we might need it for when we get out of here. I can't wait to get over to the mainland with you. Where we can finally be together for real. I'll meet you there tomorrow night like we planned i stashed the stuff near the big fallen tree in the marshy area behind saint christopher's you know where we met that one time drink your dad's contraband so there's food there we can get and that would be the church i think he was just talking about and there's got to be another house we can get into There's our accelerant. All right. But if I remember correctly, I think they've got a lantern, and that will make a, such a massive difference for us. We won't be burning through all of our damn matches. What have we here? later. go. Let's take all that water. Wasn't there a bed right here? Okay. Let's sleep for an hour. Now we're starting to get somewhere. All right, let's see what we've got. Food. Oh, well, that's it for food. All 
right, let's get out of here. Welcome to the Arctic North. Simple tools, we'll take that. Well, that's not much of a house, is it? The melting house. Oh, there's my water. That'll come in handy. Oh, there's nothing in there. can always use more food. Say, man, sooner or later we gotta come across some stuff here. I think I can use this. I do want to be careful because you can wind up overloading yourself real easy. All right, so now. Do a little repairing. That we've been getting enough stuff. That'll definitely help. And those. And where are those extra shoes? Okay, so these 
we want to do is harvest them because we get cured leather to find food. I know I need to get food. That way we can go in here and repair our boots. All right. Throw get our pants geared up. Am I out of clothing now? Almost. And let's see this vest. Better idea to repair. All right, we are good now. Always a good idea just to do a once over, look on the floors, because you never know what people leave stuff for food and the like. All I can think about is food. Oh, shut up. the longest and the hard, uh, hottest. that thing. Really? Alright, that leaves two things. We've got Milton's credit union and then the post office. Dear members, due to global economic realities that are well known to you, we are unfortunately unable to remain in operation. All banking services are hereby suspended until further notice. Gotta stop that blood loss. Okay, we can do that. Go, we gotta put it on the right thing. On the wolf bite. Oh, still got an infection risk. bang through here real quick so we can find
Pop in general tends to be fine no matter what. It's like one of the very few. Hey, must be the key to the bank manager's house. I'll be hungry later. We're gonna start taking whatever we find because we can drop it off for her. She doesn't have to have great food. She just needs food. I'm gonna go real quick. And grab that water later. Take the antibiotics. I could use this. Yeah, we'll take it with us. We won't use it right at this second. If you're curious, it is randomly generated. You get different things on every walkthrough. I better take this food. Yep. Requires a pry bar. Locked. Can't get in here yet. Well, we'll do that in a bit. This will come in handy. Sure. Yeah, if I can actually hit anything with it. Okay, so. Back over here to... Uh, bank manager's house. Because hopefully we'll find some goodies in there. And here's where we'll stop, folks. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button. Let me know you guys want to watch and see more of this. Like I said, we're just going to keep walking on through. Seeing what we have. What we can get, what we can gear up with. So keep your heads down. Your flare gun's up, and I'm not going to shoot it. And I and my boy here will see you again real damn soon.